Hey guys, welcome to Coin Time. Today I wanted to talk about why did everyone go crazy for Costco gold and silver. If you haven't been living under a rock, you've heard that everyone's buying gold and silver from Costco, including me. It's kind of become this big craze and they keep releasing gold and silver in the store and everyone keeps buying it. So why is everyone going crazy for this stuff? Well, first of all, let me just say that uh, the gold and silver they're selling is legit. I purchased these 25 gold maples here. Uh, they came sealed from the mint. I also got a killer deal on this gold buffalo and this American gold eagle. I bought this American gold eagle and gold buffalo here when spot price was $2,175 back on March 13th. I got each of these for $2,219. That was less than bullion dealers were asking for generic gold bars on that day. Roll of silver maples here for $629.99, which was $25.01 when spot was $23.15. You're getting a very low rate over spot for these, so it's already a good deal in that sense, but also you can use a credit card with no extra fee. Combine this with Costco being a trusted brand retailer, easy credit card transactions, and you have a very low friction point of sale. But here's the real thing. This is the real reason people are buying Costco gold and silver. People have special memberships from Costco that can actually allow them to get 4% back when buying precious metals. So that's where the real screaming deal is. Let me explain. With the 4% back, this actually means that you can buy under spot price. Yes, you can actually buy these metals for under spot price. For example, when gold was on March 13th, 2175, with the 4% back, you could actually pay $2,130 for this gold buffalo. That would be $45 under spot. And that is an unbelievable deal. These usually go for a hundred over spot in most cases. And this is why people went really crazy. There are a few catches though that I wanna go over if you're interested in jumping in on this Costco precious metals train. Firstly, just know there is a Reddit thread called Costco precious metals. I put the link in the description, but don't go sharing this with everyone though. We, we like to keep things small on this channel. There aren't a lot of viewers and I'm sharing this just with you guys. They have a list at the top of all the links to the SKUs that they sell on the website, and you can refresh those and see when the items go on sale. Be warned though, that they do go out of sale very quickly, sometimes within uh, a minute or two. The other thing that you need to know about this is the, how the Costco cash actually works with this 4% back. So there's actually two things you would have to do to get the 4% cash back. The first 2% back comes from the Costco City credit card. They only pay you back once per year from based on all the Costco purchases you do from the store. And there's no annual fee, but you do have to have an active Costco membership for it to stay active. And you can't redeem the 2% back on certain items like tobacco, alcohol, stamps, gift cards, uh, but most things are okay. The other 2% comes from getting a Costco executive membership, which will cost you a total of $120 a year. So if you aren't regularly shopping at Costco, this may not make sense for you. You can also just get the gold membership, which is the basic Costco at $60, but that doesn't have the 2% back. Here's the other big catch, is that most of these funds, as I have understood it, um, after looking at my dad's Costco account, is that you actually have to spend them at Costco. And if you don't want to spend them at Costco, I believe for the city credit card, and this is unverified, you have to spend over, you have to get over $300 in rewards to be able to do a direct deposit. Um, there's also a $1,000 limit to the Costco executive membership reward. So that means you'd basically would have to spend $50,000 to get that $1,000 credit. And that's the most you could get. So for some, this is actually a very viable option. If you could buy gold under spot um, and get those reward points back and you're already shopping at Costco, this actually makes a lot of sense. But I wouldn't go doing this unless you're okay with potentially having to use these points at Costco. Just, I wouldn't risk that. Um, for some, this is, this is a viable strategy, but it could also be potentially overly aggressive for others, especially if uh, gold goes down in price. But 
This is way better deal than what I'm seeing from the bullion dealers. So I think if you are looking at precious metals, this might be a good way to get into it. So now that you understand the Costco precious metals craze, are you thinking about getting in on it? It's, it's definitely not a bad way to start your journey into precious metals, um, but I'd be curious to know what your comments are. And um, I want to thank you guys for watching. So this is my Costco precious metals so far, and I will definitely be on their website checking things out later. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.